I don't think he has any idea. What, what was that? Were you talking about me? Uh, what? You left your button pressed or something. Henry, that call was work. I was just talking to... Actually, it's not really your business. Why are you freaking out? I'm not freaking out. Good. I'm gonna go quiet for a little bit. Call me if it's important. <laughs> she's pissed off at me. Alright then. Um, well, I suppose while she's walked away, I just its I just don't know where to go. Survey communication line north of the canyon. So, like, I found the canyon. But, obviously, north would be that way. But I can't get down there. Or at least I don't think I can. It's just a little bit confusing, especially when you've got to read maps and I've never been able to read maps. I'm wondering if I was actually meant to go... Um, the way that we came with the sign. If you guys remember the sign. And then just backtrack. So that's what I'm gonna do. There's some kind of freaky noise as well. Okay, so... Is it, where's the outhouse? I think it's... Is it around here? Yeah, no. Yes. So it was down here. Ah. Careful. Oh, well, oh, okay, so we're going t the way that she was. But we need to find some survey lines. Uh, survey lines, some communication lines. Not quite sure where they are. Am I just being docile and they're on the map? And I just haven't noticed? Or what? Where are we? So we're there. Uh, oh, shit. Telephone. I didn't even notice that. So we need to get. So we need to follow that down. Okay. We can get down here, can't we? Nope, put the map away. I'm sure we can get. Yeah. I got it now. I got it. I figured it out. There we go. So you come through here. It, it was on the map. I just didn't notice that the, uh, the power lines were there. So it should be over here. And is that a wire I see? I spy with my little eye. I keep forgetting the run button is row rather than shift. Yeah, it is look. There we go. So we need to basically just follow this. That sounded a bit crazy. Utility pole. Uh, I can see the wire you're talking about. It looks like it's in good shape from here. We'll follow it up to the top of the trail if you can. You can head back as soon as you give me the all clear. Got it. Okay. I mean, there is a few down trees, so. Uh, 
So we really can't reach anyone any other way than these wires? What else do you suggest? Smoke signals? Just seems dangerous. Well, if they don't hear from me for a few days, they'll send someone out. But I'd rather it not come to that. Yep. What's this? Another, uh... Uh, hey, I found a structure that might have been an outhouse once, I think. Whoa, uh, you don't need my permission to go to the bathroom, <laughs> but, you know, use abandoned shitters at your own peril. I mean, uh, I'm in the right area? I do believe. Oh, uh, the comms wire runs for quite a ways. Follow it all the way to the top of Beartooth Point, and if it's not damaged, you can loop around back home. Ugh. I found a really old house. Anything I should know about the cabin at the top of this hill? Hello? Okay then. Wow. So that's not creepy or anything. But we've got a supply case anyway. No maps or anything? Ha! Huh. huh. Found an old hat from a Korean war vet. You'd be surprised how many former service members take this gig. I well, don't makes really know. I imagine if you've been through war, you probably can't get enough silence. Wow. Ruined fire. This looks like another camp somewhere. That noise is really loud and creepy. Um, Jesus. Let's just drop it. Oops. <laughs> That's a big drop. I don't want to stay in this house anymore because it's kind of freaking me the fuck out. So let's just follow these poles. Uh, and it kind of scared me that she didn't reply to that. Uh, here we go. Oh, wow, how much walking are we going to do? I'm guessing that's the tip. I'm guessing that's where we're going to go. Uh, looks like a real nice place, though. Oh, I thought, uh... I thought we could talk to her then for a sec. Oh, wow, really? You're telling me that I've run all this way and we can't do anything? <sighs> Are you down here? Nope. Nah, we're getting down here. Guess I'm just gonna go up there. Oh, what the fuck was that? That was a bit freaky. Oh, what's this? Oh, beer cam. Guess what? What is it? There's a bunch of empty cans up here. Same as before. Yep. These fucking kids. Why do you think they'd be up here? How are these girls? Might not be girl. In fact, no, it would be because yeah, because it's the same cans as before. How could these girls be so stupid? <sighs> Trust me, I never underestimate the stupidity oh. of a drunk teenager. Also, I never Careful. underestimate the balls of a drunk young woman, having been one. Oh. Uh. Oh. Oh, can't pick that one up. Oh, I'll pick that one up, so it looks like that glitched. Cool. Co oh. Oh. Uh, yeah, okay. oh, it is. Down here. Okay, good. Any sign of those girls? Did they mess with anything? I'll look around. Oh, shit. It's been cut. Well, that's not freaky or anything. What does that say? Go. I can't remember how to zoom in. Oh, go to hell. Wow. Nice. Hey, so the wire is definitely down out here. I just found it. Yeah, the thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was cut deliberately. I knew it. The moment you said you found their trash. Right. Ugh, these idiots are gonna pay. Do they realize this is how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? And God forbid there's an actual fire burning out of control. What do you want to do? I want you to go find them. And then what? 
I... I haven't thought that far ahead. That's not true. Everything that comes to mind is illegal. Oh, that's oh. where she is. Let's hear it. It's quite close. Oh, yeah? Hey, I came out here for a breath of fresh air and some adventure. What do you got? I think I want you to just find them and scare the hell out of them. <laughs> yeah, I'd make a spooky ghost costume, but they stole my sheets. Hmm, I don't know. Um, wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp. Something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy. <laughs> I'll find them. Thanks. But I am going to need a raise. <sighs> don't hold your breath. I'd start by hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything that would lead you to them. We'll follow in a big into Red Eagle. <laughs> yeah. Great. See if you can find the path they took down from there. Maybe they looped back around towards the lake or something. I doubt they're where they were yesterday, but they obviously can't have gone far. What we got? It said I could talk, then I'm sure it did. Fire lookout. So that's where I need to go. Jordan Lake. Probably this way then, isn't it? If they've not gone... If they're not going to go the way that they did before, they'll probably go up here. Probably. Maybe. Uh, let's play a drop. Fire lookout. What's up? I'm sure I saw something up here though. Ah. Oh, it's another... Uh, supply crate. It's quite, quite big, this one. Oh shit. One, two, three. Cool, cool. Oh shit. Uh, and there's nothing in it. <laughs> nice. Let's close it. No. So we can't get anywhere from here. Don't think, unless it's up. Oh, it's up here. Okay. Hey, I'm out at a ravine. What's this thing that spans across it? That is how you get to my sector. No kidding. Well, let me hike over. Well, it's locked up and mainly for emergencies. I've never actually used it. Rangers use it from time to time, but that's it. Help! Oh, God, it's an emergency! <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, I got, I, got, um, I got eyes on a tornado. I gotta get out of here. <laughs> tornado in the heart of the Rockies? Yes! Holy moly, I need to call this in. Tom, Two Forks sees a tornado. He says he needs an evac into my sector. It's a meteorological impossibility. There haven't been tornadoes in the greater Yellowstone region in a hundred million years. You're gonna need him to stay and take a detailed personal account, even if it means giving his life. Okay, I'll tell him. <laughs> Sorry, Hank. No dice. <laughs> Man. Oh. So we can't get across there then. So. Well, at least it's worth a try and a look. But I think we can get back to our own base through the other way. I just hope that I'm on the right track. Oh, actually, what did this this one say? Uh, through a fair fire lookout. Okay, so yeah, that's the way to get to her. And I'm guessing the other sign down here was the way to get to mine. I'm thinking so anyway. Yeah, two folks lookout. Yeah, yeah, that's right. So it's over here somewhere. Place is goddamn beautiful, and these. What is that? There's an abandoned pack out here. And it's not one of the teens? Nope. No, it looks like it was lost a long time ago. Yeah. Well, you could always pilfer it for supplies. Looks like someone snapped. What's that, sir? Brian Goodwin. Oh, wow. I actually turned my head upside down to read that, but it just says it. Oh, fucking hell. Ooh, some rope. Well, I am flush with ropes now. Beautiful. The pack was full of them. In decent condition, too. That's lucky. I mean, there's there's enough rope here that I could just leave them hooked up, I think. 
Oh, get this. This uh, pack came with one of those cardboard single-use cameras. With pictures left? Yeah, he only used three or four. Neato. Thank you, Brian Goodwin. Wait, wait, who? The bag had the name Brian Goodwin sewn into the top. Uh... Huh. Wow. Do you know him? Yeah, Ooh. I just haven't heard that name in a few years. Look out, Ranger X Lover, X Lover. What was he, a fella you had a thing with? Mm, yeah, it was so hot and heavy. <laughs> of course, Brian Goodwin was 12 years old, so, you know, our love could never really be understood. Oh dear. <laughs> I'm kidding. Not about him being an actual 12 year old. That part's true. <laughs>